Hello, my fellow gamers. Welcome, welcome back to the game here. Welcome back to Deadly Premonition 2. Last time, we got our next oracle. It told us to come to Memorial Oak Tree Street. Um, we decided to try Free Quest. It really was not a good time. Because they're not actually the side quests that I was looking for. Off screen, I figured out this is what the side quest I'm looking for, and they are the dumbest and not fun side quest I've ever seen. I'm gonna talk to this tree right here. Zap, do you sense that? Nope. These trees have watched over this land for the past 300 years. Have they now? Long before the Clarksons built up their town, these trees were here. If they could speak, I wonder what they'd have to say about this case. Has there always been a different number of trees on each side? Yeah. I heard that by the time our town came along, there were only 17 left. Well, why is this one gone? A general from the south might have cut one down during the Civil War. Intriguing, Patty. Why did he cut one down? I don't know. Folks say he planted a red tree in its place. I don't know if that's true or not, though. Red tree. Red tree. So, uh -oh. the shape of these seeds. They look just like the ones we saw at Lisa's altar. Patty, it appears that legend about the red tree wasn't a total lie. The first tree is withered and gone, but the shells from its seeds remain. Perhaps that red tree left some descendants somewhere else. Dog? Ah! It's just a dog. That has no eyes. Yeah. Zack, he seems to know something that we don't. It's a dog, we always do. Doesn't it seem like he's trying to guide us somewhere? Um, yeah. What? What's going on? Change Person. of plans, Patty. Let's go on a little stroll with that Dalmatian. Okay. Follow the eerie Dalmatian. Dog go fast, man. I didn't expect it to take off like that. I also didn't expect, you know, to follow a dog to figure out a, qu a case. Hmm. Where the heck are you gonna- I have a feeling it's gonna take me forever. I probably couldn't get on the skateboard because I probably- because it gets rid of a lot of the, uh, things out there. But... It's all at Oak Tree still. We're getting kind of close to the water tower. We're only 500 feet away now. <laughs> Kinda. We're going to the trailer park portion? Where are you taking me? Hi, random woman. Red tree. Red tree. At least the Lord doesn't hunger anymore. Cause that was gonna be repetitive. Like So the side quests are miscellaneous things that you just have to do. I see a red tree, I think. But it's more of a like, the stamps, I'm not gonna get all the stamps. I've kind of determined that because one of them's die a hundred times. We're in chapter three of the game. How many times have I died? If 
your answer is zero, you're correct. Dog, I see the tree. I guess you can't go to the real tricks at the water plant? That's a pretty red tree though. I wonder if I can just run to it. But run all casually walk as my stamina regains. Hmm. Yep, oh, rip stamina. Look at the red tree. Red tree? Yeah, I see. Is this the red tree that General planted? No way! This is a maple tree. A maple tree? Then it shouldn't be red at this time of year. You're right. That's strange. A long time ago, my mama and daddy used to come here together a lot. They told me they used to go on dates here, back before I was born. Mama would make sandwiches, then they'd come here and eat them together. My mama was really pretty, you know. When I was a kid, I believed she was a real goddess. Don't use that term in this game. Under the boughs of a legendary tree that stayed red all year long, a small miracle was born. Wait. One man managed to win the heart of the most beautiful girl in the world. And they call him Melvin Woods. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like it's time to move on. What a fantastic guide we managed to find. He actually waited for us to finish talking before taking us on to the next spot. Up it again, up it again. Where are we going now? Is there another guy? Okay, I can't just skateboard. I think it's gonna be easier just to hit it once and just. We are at the water trip point. You probably will believe there's a lot more water utilities out there than you probably ever expect. But even this little town has its own. All right, dog. The free. All right, we're making the right turn, people. Uh oh, he's going left now. But. I mean, I will cover all the side quests and how to get them at the end of the game. Because I feel like they're going to be completely irrelevant. I will touch on the free sides as I can because I do need to get some sort of upgrades. Where are we going? Okay, we're going here. So, what candy is that big woman that was in the boat randomly? So, that wouldn't make sense. I didn't even mean to think that. I was thinking more of the, uh... Crap. We haven't seen Candy yet. And Candy belongs at the house. There's no way... That doesn't even make sense. Especially with beauty standards. The big one being Candy. But it could be the missing Clark's sister. Which is what I'm leaning to. But we just haven't really touched on it since. And who was with her at the time? Wait, hitting the dog loses one durability? Man, I don't like that. <laughs> I'm just having fun on the skateboard. Why'd you do that, dog? <laughs> Alright. This is 
most irregular pattern ever. You're going the wrong way. Is that the owl's nest beside us? Uh-oh. Hmm. Wait, is he taking us there? No, uh, okay. I have no freaking clue what his plan is then. <laughs> this dog is just taking us for a run, and I hate it. Wait, where are we on the map? I'm curious. I have no idea. No, what? No, no, where? Oh, discovery site. <laughs> Wait, there's another one. And this tree is solid red. Red tree? Now that looks like a red tree. Hey, Patty. How would you rate this creation? Not bad, I reckon. They made good use of its natural form while also pulling out the soul from within. What? The artificial color also looks pretty. You don't usually see this level of harmony. Something unnatural always ends up getting left behind. Zach, did you catch all that? Uh, unnatural part sounds too accurate. Okay, what? She sounded just like the curator of an art gallery in New York. I think we may have just uncovered a new side of her. But unfortunately, I can't see anything artistic about it. Honestly, it looks insane to me. That's all I get from it. What? And there's no way that this is a descendant of the tree that the general planted. No. <sighs> Again? Okay, so where were my endless ramblings about this game? So far, it doesn't have the charm of the first one. Like, it has the quirkiness. But, gameplay feels about the same, which is cool. Actually, probably would look better, really. But, bosses are nothing. As you tell, we've kind of, like, destroyed bosses. It's not even on easy or anything. 100 percent in the game just doesn't seem feasible. Like, you probably could easily 100%. What? You just pulled an oopty loop on me. Can I even swim in this game? I can't. By the way, you can't swim in this game. I don't think you could in the first game either. But... Why didn't you just take the bridge, doggy? Oh, 
That organ does sound really good there for this music theme. Music is phenomenal in this game, though. Much better than like the four tracks of Version One. But I guess I am trying to judge the game based on the first one, where the first one was probably one of the top ten favorite games ever. I freaking love that game. And this is kind of just it's like a lot of games in life. You get you get hope for a sequel. And you get disappointed because your expectations are too high. But, you know, it kind of happens with a lot of things in life. Okay, dog. We're gonna fight. I mean, I think Red Dead 2 is the last game I feel like that lived up to its hype. Like that for sequels. I know Valve can't count to three. But I really love Left 4 Dead 3. Back for Blood ain't it. Actually, Back 4 Blood's a good example of my hype. My, I was let down by that game. You're probably wondering why I didn't say Half Life 3 or Portal 3. Half Life doesn't. I like the original Half Life. Because I actually played when I was a, lot, was a kid. I couldn't really get into Half-Life 2. I kind of watched it and still didn't understand why I got the hype. Because the Big Engine is amazing, but that's about it. And Portal to me is one of those overrated things that ever came out. The quirkiness is there, but I just don't see how people have fun with it. But you do you. I'm not going to judge you for liking the game or not. It's more of a... Uh, Eh. No, I'd rather not per play it personally. Okay, where are we going, doggo? You're gonna go left. Yeah. Because we are getting close to Lena's house. You're about to juke me go straight left, though. You are juking me to go straight left, though. Wait. What? What? What just happened? The game just yeeted me. And I don't appreciate that. Dog is more trolly this time. Okay, I guess we're not going to let us know. Blizzard skin, yeah. What? Where the heck are we going? To the sugarcane field? Oh. Okay, I cannot... Oh, freak. Oh, freak. Get off. We lost the dog. Oh, freak. I lost the dog. Goofing around. Because you can't walk through it, and he can. Appears that we've lost sight of our guide, Zack. Uh, I gotta achieve it for that. No. All right. So let's not do anything stupid this time. 
Actually, it's been two in-game hours to start in the last, like, 25 to 30 minutes, so I'm actually trying to figure out what, how, I want to say every four minutes is a minute. Okay, so we're going to help the skateboard, because that's what screwed me last time. Which way did you end up going? Okay, so that was been, I don't know how I didn't see you then. Uh, doggo! Okay, you can't do that. Oh no, oh no. That's a big old red tree. Oh. I think that's the tree we're looking for. Can we start going right? I want to see the big giant red tree over there. Red tree. Good. Yes, that's very good. Whoa. There's a lot of problems with this tree. Zach, now this is interesting. It looks like a tree that you could find anywhere, yet it's also unlike any other, completely alien. And look how it's weaved its way into the landscape. Almost like cancer cells invading a human body. You might not even notice it unless you're focused on finding it. And this feeling. As I gaze upon this tree, I can feel evil emotions rising out from within me. Why on earth did that southern general bring this tree into this town? I promise to protect you from all the evil in our world. Do not touch this tree. Got that, Patty? Got it, Agent York. <laughs> we successfully spoke with the 17 comrades. I feel like they showed us a side of nature that transcends the realms of human knowledge. Next up is the Holy Allah. According to the Oracle, the Holy Allah needs to be filled. We may be due for another childish puzzle soon, Zack, but that's okay. After all, we came all the way out here to the boondocks. Why not enjoy playing by their rules for a bit? Uh. Okay, but I have one problem. There is zero... Well, I could have literally went straight... Alright, game. You kind of irritated me. Were you thinking about Galena, too? And no, all the not. other women we've seen so far? Chinese. Next time on Deadly Premonition 2, let's go feel the Holy Allah. Why is that red? Hold up. That's kind of. Stone skipping is red. That's weird. I have no interest Wait, in stone skipping. Anyway, should be white. I'll see you next time.